We had mass at the fire station. Um, we, we went all over the community until we decided we needed to have our own building. We needed to raise money to build that wonderful church that we have down, down below. We started probably back in 2005, 2006. And we first started making dog biscuits. And then we had a couple of rummage sales and from that we decided to do a thrift store. And we were in a uh, building that's right up on the top of the hill that was given to us to use. It was a wonderful thing to have, but it was not in great shape. It had no heat, it had no air conditioning, and the plumbing and the electricity were like marginal. So we continued to raise money through that store and through our dog biscuits, and we were able to raise enough money to build a church, and then we were able to raise enough money to build this building, which is just a delight to be in. The thrift store probably has been around for maybe 10 years. We've been in this building since August. A parishioner came up with the idea of angel wings, and it just seemed so appropriate for us to, to be angels in the community and, and spreading our wings throughout the community. Everyone has a part in this. It starts with our donors, and we have fabulous donors. We're looking today at new items that have come in that still have tags on them. So we have very, very generous donors. I think that thrift stores have become much more popular as people understand the need to protect our climate and reuse things rather than just going out and buying. And it's just, it's just a great uh, place to be. We have a manager of the month, so we take turns managing the store, but pretty much the volunteers all know what to do and they all sort of pitch in and, and do their thing. And we have quite a cadre of, of um, women, mostly women, who um, do all our sorting and pricing and meeting with customers. It's, it's, a, it's a very much a, a group effort. And that is, is so important for keeping this place going. It is amazing. It is a uh, destination for people. We have regular customers who think that we spend all week putting out new items, and so they all come on Thursdays, which is the first day we're open. So we've set up a mission for the organization, which is uh, we strive to be a light in the community. And because we no longer are building buildings, we're able to take some of our proceeds and give them to other local charities.